The following opinions are solely those of BoatTest.com and its test captain. The Beneteau Sense 55 is the largest boat in the Sense line, and she has three main missions in life. First, she's a luxurious cruising sailboat. Second, she's a comfortable club day racer. And third, she's a spectacular entertainment platform. In all of these activities, the boat's huge cockpit will be the main gathering spot. Because Beneteau has located the twin steering wheels as far aft as possible, a great expanse of cockpit space has been opened up. The focal point for guests is the large U-shaped settee that can seat five people under sail and as many as eight people for lunch or dinner. The table has three positions, all the way up for dining, mid-height to serve as a cocktail or coffee table, and all the way down to make a platform for lounging or napping. To port, there's a wide bench seat that seats four people, or two if they're sprawled out. Aft, we have the twin helm seats that are wide enough for two adults each. So all told, under sail, the cockpit can hold at least 13 adults. When in water sports mode at anchor, the two helm seats swing up out of the way, allowing unrestricted access to the entire width of the Teak Beach swim platform. In the platform, there are large compartments for swim fins, goggles, and water toys. There's a five-step boarding ladder with teak treads and good handholds. Scuba divers will appreciate the large, deep compartments under the seating where an air compressor, tanks, and other gear can live. Open up the hatch, and the engine room can be conveniently accessed. When cruising, I highly recommend getting the optional dodger that fits to the standard arch over the aft end of the coach roof. And no cruising boat should be without a canopy or bimini over the cockpit. The Sense 55 we sailed aboard had an optional spoiler arch off the stern, which not only supports things like the wind generator shown, but also can be used to mount domes for sat TV and sat phone and other devices. Most important for a cruising boat, it can also support davits for a large tender without board. Going below, the first thing that struck me was how much light came streaming into the salon and galley. No fewer than 15 windows, port lights, and hatches pour light into this 133 square foot space from five different directions. There is six foot six inches of headroom throughout the boat. To port is the settee, which seats six people. With the fold away seat on the island deployed, two more can be seated. The optional deluxe adjustable table has multiple height settings for dining or cocktails. The standard table is on a fixed panel. Kids will like the optional electrically actuated TV that rises out of the island. A chart table with electronic gear and the ship's electrical panel is next to the companionway. I measured about 15 linear feet of counter space in the galley, counting the island. For cocktail parties below, it can be used as an incredibly long sideboard. When cruising, the chef will like the island which provides support when on a starboard tack. Two or three people can work in this galley at the same time, which is unusual for any boat. A three burner gas stovetop with oven below is standard along with a refrigerator that opens from both the top and the side. In the corner is a top-loading freezer. There's a huge amount of storage space for pots, pans, dishes, and provisions, and Beneteau has used every available bit of space for the ship's larder. My only suggestion for the galley is for higher fiddles on the counters. The Sense 55 sleeps six people in three staterooms, each with a private head. Down a long passageway in the bow is the master stateroom ambient light and the light color fruit wood LP joinery keeps the space bright. The bed measures 5 foot 7 inches at its widest point and is 6 feet 8 inches long. There are his and hers hanging lockers each with four shelves for folded garments and a shoe bin. On the port side is a vanity or desk with stool and more cubbies. The master head is divided in two with a large stall shower to port and the toilet and sink to starboard in its own compartment. Another unusual feature of the Sense 55 is her twin guest staterooms. By using pocket doors, Beneteau has been able to install double beds that are over 5 feet wide at the head and 6 foot 7 inches long. There's a single hanging locker with four shelves for garments. Outboard above the berth are more storage cabinets and a large port light. Forward, each cabin has a nearly identical wet head. The Sense 55 has all the basic equipment needed for cruising, day racing, and entertaining, but Beneteau has a long options list 
so that owners can outfit the boat for their specific type of cruising and geographic location. So that's our detailed look at the features of the Beneteau Sense 55. For BoatTest.com, I'm Captain John Wenz.